now a warrant active for a now former Waller ISD coach and teacher accused of having sexual relations with a student. Joseph Anthony Mata is facing a felony charge of indecency with a child. Brittany Jeffers is live on the story from Waller this morning. Brittany. Now we do want to point out we did reach out to Waller ISD and the district tells us that at this point Mata's employment has been terminated. Now according to these court documents Mata was a biology teacher. He was also a high school volleyball coach and we're going through these documents it alleges that he was having an inappropriate relationship with a 15 year old student and some of that alleged contact happening at the school. So again Mata's facing a felony charge of indecency with the child and looking at these court documents filed with the Harris County Clerk's Office Mata is accused of having sexual contact with a 15 year old female student beginning in 2021 which continued through last year. These documents say alleged inappropriate contact took place in the coach's office and storage area at Waller High School. Mata is accused of asking the student to go to the school bathroom and take and send photos of her body to him. Now the alleged sexual relations uh, allegedly taking place at the, in the defendant's apartment and the defendant's car. This is according to those documents. Now, KPRC did reach out to Waller ISD regarding these allegations, and we were told by representatives that Mata's uh, employment with the district was terminated on January 13th. They also forwarded us a statement that was sent out to parents, which shows in part that administrators received a tip on the 5th of January through the district's anonymous reporting app alleging an inappropriate relationship between a staff member and student. It also states an investigation involving the Harris County Sheriff's Office then began. So in that letter that was sent out to parents, the superintendent also stated in part that the district will never tolerate a student's safety being put in jeopardy. We will act quickly and pursue disciplinary action to the fullest extent of the law. Now at this point in time, Mata has not been booked into the Harris County Jail. Reporting live from Waller this morning, I'm Brittany Jeffers, KPRC 2 News.